torso target. Make note of those hits. Got the Smith & Wesson 66 357 Magnum out. Going to be shooting some 38 special loads. First load is a 125 grain using the Hornady XP HTP or HP XTP. And then we got the 150 grain. And then I screwed that one up. I'm going to take one more shot and it'll be up in here with these. That last shot hit there. So the 125 uh, height is somewhere around in there. You know, maybe a little bit lower. Okay, so the 158s are hitting higher, probably about a half an inch, you know. These two shots are about that high, you know, that's about the same height as these two. So these two shots are basically telling the tale, you know, about a half an inch higher. Now that's a less than a minute, um, you know, at 60 yards that's less than a minute, it's probably like a, just a little bit less than a minute. And then uh, were my, my other shots at 25 yards, 158s hit like an inch and a half higher. That's like six minutes. So this is dropping from six minutes, being the 158s were six minutes higher, and now they're only less than a minute higher. At 70 yards, I'm sure they're gonna be lower, at least by that half inch. You know, this barrel is two and a half inches. Well, with my eight and three eight inch barrel, 357, shooting these same loads, the 158s were 14 minutes higher than the 125s at 25 yards, but then they were two minutes lower at 100 yards. That's 16 minutes difference with 75 yards. This is 35 yards more, and we see a five minute difference. You know. It, you know, maybe I'll try 65 yards tomorrow instead of 70 because it's going to be close 